physical therapist. Could I get your full name and date of birth? Yep, it's Chris Jenna, and it's January 1st, 1990. Cool. Can I double check that on your... Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Um, could I, we're just fitting you for crutches. Okay. So the first thing I'm gonna measure is two inches lateral to your toes. So if you could just move the um, crutch in a little bit, that'd be great. Perfect. And then we're also gonna measure it four to six inches in front of your in front of your toes. So if you could move the crutch straight up four inches. Perfect. We're gonna do that again on this side. So if you could move this crutch in a little bit, thank you. And then same thing, four inches anterior to your foot. Perfect. Next we're gonna measure uh, from the axilla to the top of the crutch. This should be two inches. Looks good. Do the other side. Perfect. And then if you notice, her elbows are bent about 20 to 25 degrees. Okay, so we're gonna be doing non-weight bearing walking with crutches. Um, so technique for this, she's gonna want to move the crutches forward and then step all the way through with her weight bearing foot. As a therapist, I wanna be on her non-weight bearing side, so the right side in this case. I'm gonna have my left arm supinated, holding onto the skate belt. My right arm, I'm gonna be guarding her shoulder as she's walking. And then for my positioning, I'm gonna wanna be behind her non-weight bearing foot and the crutch um, with my other leg trailing behind me as we move. So whenever you're ready, you can go ahead. Okay. All right, so today we're gonna to be doing partial weight bearing uh, with the crutches. So what the patient is gonna do, is she's gonna advance the crutches forward simultaneously with the partial weight bearing leg, and then step through the crutches with her full weight bearing leg. Um, positioning for me is gonna be the same as uh, the last one. So whenever you're ready, you can go ahead. All right. 